This tip, we're going to go over a PDF converter, which is actually a PDF printer. Um, and you may be wondering why you need a PDF printer to begin with. Uh, but PDF printers are really um, convenient because you can use basically any program and convert it into, uh, give it the option to um, save as a PDF file. Because if that uh, application can print, then it can use uh, this PDF converter. So you may wonder why you need a PDF converter in the first place. Well, if you are um, doing a lot of online payments or um, doing a lot of things online, you may want to keep records of that. And instead of printing out a physical copy of that every time, you can pr basically print out a PDF of that. And that will preserve all the images, all the formatting, of that page, um, just as if you printed out the the actual page on a physical piece of paper. So uh, it's just the same as saving it uh, as as printing it out. And then as soon as you um, create a PDF file, you can upload that to a backup um, piece of backup service like Evernote or even email it to yourself on Gmail, and you'll always have a copy of that. Um, particular piece of um, information. If it's your credit card bill or your credit card payment information, that's all um, preserved for you. Um, so let's go over real quick how to use BullZip PDF printer. Well, first you need to just go into any program that you have. Um, here we're in Chrome and I'm going to print out um, just a random Wikipedia article and you can as soon as you click the print button, it'll come up with the um, BullZip dialog with a series of uh, options for you. First, you can decide where you want to save the file. That's that first option there. And then you can fill in some um, information about the file if you uh, if you like, maybe author name and things. You can set a watermark um, if you'd like, uh, maybe if you... Um, if you work for a particular company and you want to watermark your logs, you can do it that way. Um, the, the next option is you can append the PDF to uh, a PDF that already exists. So if you're doing daily reports, you can append this to a yearly uh, log. And the last menu is for um, if you want to put a username and password on your PDF. So if you want to password protect it. Uh, that's where you can do that in this uh, last that last menu box. So lots of options, pretty much everything you need um, out of a PDF printer, and it's absolutely free. So um, you can download BullZip PDF printer at this address. Uh, download it and tell me what you think. For more tips just like this one that show you exactly how to get the most out of your computer, Come visit us at 100 Things to Do When You're Bored. That's 100 Things to Do When Y-O-U-R Bored.com.